work for you a bit better like in the long run so yeah it's a good starter camera i'll say good loosely it takes good photos and it's an option just photographs yeah you'll be fine with that if there's no video at all you can use that uh you can look at hmm have you thought about the 4000d there is a slight difference between the two models uh, the 4000d and the two, let me bring up on screen for you i can show you so you've got 4000d there's about what 509 that little kit deal um the 4000d and then you've got the 2000d there's a variance of a few things you've got a metal mount camera system which is basically where the lens mounts into so it's made a bit more robustly and you're gonna get 1080p video and let me let me give you a side by side so you can see it oh you're seeing the wrong screen there <laughs> You normally see my camera there, but you don't see the camera because I'm doing this guide on this uh, SL3. Okay, so let me bring up the side by side for you. So if I go just like that and go, I'm bringing it up for you now. Yeah, it'll go. I can't the lens over. I don't think there's much, there's probably about $80 difference between the two. Just bringing it up for you now. So the one of them's 18 megapixels and one's 24 megapixels. So if you're doing photos, I think you will benefit from that extra megapixels there. Keep that in mind. That's like a, a is worth is worth paying that little 80 dollars extra for the extra megapixels you get. Uh, bam, bam, bam. Let's check. Now I'm gonna bring the side by side up for you. So if I go comparison, Amazon. Let's do side by side. Let's go. 2000 known as a T7. And then 4000. If it's only photo. Me, okay, we go. So yeah, 2018. Compact SLR. The T7 is the 2000D. Okay, because these, I have a little. Because in different countries they call it by different names, I've actually had to write down which ones they are. So 4000D is known as a T100, also 3000D. 2000D is a T7. And then you're looking at T7, which is the 2000D. So, okay, you have picked the better one because the 2000D does have the names on these get so confusing. The T7 is the 2000D. It's got 24 megapixels. The 4000 has got 18 megapixels. So you picked the right one uh, in that budget anyway. How much is a T7 though? Let's have a look at that price. They both shoot three frames a second. They both do 1080p. Okay. So how much, how much are you spending on it? Let me check how much is going on for today. They have had offers on them. Let's go Amazon. Let's go shop. Because I reckon for a little bit more money, you might be. So if I go 2000D, how much are they going for today? Hmm. Okay. Is this the one you've seen? Let me go here. Is this the one you're looking at? T7, $549. Because I reckon for a little bit more money, you could... Pro what's your budget? Like, what's the max you can go to? Because considering... But yeah, it's, it's one of the best sellers on Amazon. Or oh, the 28 piece. Mm, okay, I'm not a big fan of the ones that give you like a bundle deal. Because you basically get a lot of cheap... Wait, let me go back. Let me bring the one up. Uh, so you're probably looking at... They're bundled together loads of like cheap things that won't be very good. You're better off buying the camera and buying a separate good tripod. For example, let me show you this one. Let's go here. Okay, let me get, let me get rid of that screen because otherwise that screen's going to be confusing. I've got that up there, that, that. Let me bring my other one up here. If I go there. Let's go copy. Let's go there. Let's go paste. Ah, uh, yeah. Of course it's going to give me the wrong one, isn't it? So let's go wide. Let's go top down. 
So temp has go copy. There we go. you can see me now uh, yeah so the 28 piece one is gonna be probably one of these ones is that 28 okay yeah 28 piece one so 569 the memory cards okay fair enough that flash is not gonna be very good those little lens adapters aren't gonna give you any good image quality the tripods are uh, a starting tripod so I tend to buy the camera and then buy the pieces separately but then again wait a minute you're getting see you can tell the quality of the the things they're giving you with it because the price for it 569 they're literally giving you everything for it free aren't they because it's what 569 but the camera itself is 586 is this by Canon brand P that's interesting development isn't it okay brand Jerry's photo let me have a look. Is there a better deal on today? Have I got my thing? Let me see what. Let me see if I can. Uh, let me see if I can find you a better deal. Because here's a good, here's a good camera to start off with. It's like a. I would probably get the SL3, which is this one. That camera is. I like that better because it gives you more features and you'll be able to not have to upgrade for a long time with this camera. Basically, get some lenses and you're good to go. Um, okay, let's go back here. Let me see if I can get 27. What's the best price on at the moment? There must be some saving for you. I get you a better deal. Okay, the 549, 579, 529, 519. Can we do better than that? 519 is the best we could do. 519. Let's see what the difference between the 519 one is and the 569. Okay, 519. Add. Okay, go back. Uh, return to live stream let's quickly feature that okay, here so that one's mm, okay yeah it's not there's not a bad deal is it? it's that's 619 i'm surprised how the the prices have gone up slightly it, they were cheaper is it I, I always talk about these on the live stream 699 579 but the camera itself for a long time where, where's the f there used to be one at 459 is it because they call it t7 let's try are you in the uk or are you in the us unless they've sold out of those ones okay oh okay there's an option here you can't see that you can yeah so it's called the t7 in america if it's it is renewed which basically means it's like what's the other word refurbished but it's 472 49 we could get a really good lens after that like a 51.8 or something to go with it but it depends if you're happy with the it being renewed it's basically repack it if it uh, Amazon repackage it is like another word for refurbished. Uh, renewed 549 519. Okay, that's a good one. Ah, uh, US. Okay, so yeah, in the US they call it the two, yeah, because you call it 2000D, but we call it 2000D in the UK and Europe. In America, you would refer to it as a T7. That's like the American version, same camera, just different name. Five 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 five. Okay, what about this one here? Ah, still international model. There, so it's four hundred nineteen ninety five. Okay. What? I reckon if you think about the types of photos you get, and if you are able to put a bit more money in it. Like not a lot more, but if you can, if you look at the camera I was looking at originally, like the this the 250D, known as the SL3, 
you're gonna get a lot more bang for your buck so if i do a side by side comparison against that let me show you the differences 